Easy peasy, squeeze the lemon, swing rule question. Find X to one decimal place for three marks. All right. Even sine rule, cosine rule, whatever, it's all about the angle and its opposite length, okay? So here I can see X, which I'm trying to find, and I can see its opposite angle, okay? Now, if I was going to use the sine rule, then I'll need to find another pair. Well, this 26 has an opposite length, and this length has an opposite unknown angle. So which one are we going to choose? Well, actually, we can work out this angle super easy by doing angles in a triangle add up to 180. So you're going to do 180 minus 34 minus 26, which I ain't doing that in my head. 120. Looks about right. So now we have the opposites. What does the sign rule say? It says, if you take a length on a triangle and you divide it by its opposite sine angle, that's the same no matter which opposites you had looked at. So that's the same as taking this length and dividing it by its opposite sine angle. Yeah, the ratios are all equal. So the last thing we need to do is rearrange your x. We're going to do the opposite of dividing by sine 34, which is to times both sides by sine 34. Okay, so x is approximately 23.8 over sine 120 times sine 34. So about 15, so 1 dp 15 point 0.4, because it's 0 0.36 uh, centimeters. And that's that. So don't forget, guys, we have the cram courses I'm hosting day before your exam, going through some key topics. You don't want to miss it. Head to my bio if you want to sign up. I'll see you guys there and on YouTube for more mass videos. Nice.